Welcome back to Metro Pro Wrestling here on Metro yes. Sports. <laughs> I love these guys. Main event time here, Chris. The Hooligans, Devin and Mason Cutter, along with my personal favorite of the group, their little brother, Neil Diamond Cutter. They get another shot at the tag team finals. And maybe they learned a lesson. Last time they resorted to illegal tactics and got disqualified. Yeah, they accidentally kicked one of the heroes prior to the crotch. That's, that will get you deep here. Yeah, it's so like kicking the trunk. Is that their, one of their long lost uncles? Yeah, it's DA Cutter. You can figure out what DA stands for. Mason Cutter telling Neil Diamond that you better help out in this match. They're brothers and blood is thicker than water. We saw that guy, what, just a couple of weeks ago. He had that match with Mad Dog McDowell, and him and Mad Dog are raising their hands with each other like they're friends. Yeah, it was great sportsmanship. I love that. That was one of the best moments so far in Metro Pro Wrestling. You know what? I hope your kids grow up and they turn on you just like that because that is blood is thicker than water. You don't care. Friendship, who cares? That's family there. Pro, I know why you don't have any friends. Team champions, so, Jimmy Rockwell I got friends. And Zach Thompson. Yeah, yeah the Heroes Kansas City Killers. Need your team right for commissioner. With friends like that, who needs enemies? Hey, they can be very powerful very soon. Here comes the hero for hire, Dan. Yeah, speaking of powerful, how about these guys? They've had the Metro Pro Tag Team belts forever, Chris. It's been almost a year since these guys took down the Brew City Bruisers, and they defeated them to become the Metro Pro Tag Team Champions. They put up some fights, but they've always managed to retain them. And the hooligans, though, Dave, this team has been putting up the biggest challenges for this team up to date. Heroes for Hire have been on a roll. They know they need to be on the lookout for some dirty tricks from these guys in the ring, the hooligans. You never know what they're going to do. Well, except you know they're going to cheat in pretty much every single match whenever possible. Dave, have you seen the athleticism of the cutters? I'll Are you amazing? Credit. I'll give them credit. For big guys, they're incredibly athletic. They can I do just a, hate their attitude. A standing moonsault, all the double team maneuvers he's got. These guys are a well oiled on, machine. I've never Heroes seen the likes of it. Heroes for Hire, yeah, they got their high flying moves, but the hooligans? They're brutal and agile. It's amazing. Oh, they're trying to get the crowd involved where the heroes for hire. They get cheap shot from behind here at the start of the match. Look at this. Double Irish whip, duck under. Oh, double drop kick. Look at that momentum going all the way, and the two cutters get out. What are you doing, Neil Diamond? Just sitting there holding your hands up? Help them out. Rub it out. They need some help. See who's going to get things started here for the heroes for hire. Big sliding double drop kick there. Boy, the challengers are in rough shape to get this match started. Those stupid streamers are still everywhere. Where's the damn janitor? Well, Domino's here, but he's no longer the administrative assistant, Chris. Look at this! Oh, oh, oh. oh. Unbelievable. Somersault in the air and takes out both the cutters. You gave credit to the cutters. How about give some credit to Heroes for Hire for their tag team maneuvers? Hey, we all know that they're high flyers, Dave. They've been champions for over a year now. Yes, they definitely bring it when they're tag team champs for a year, but the hooligans, look at that face buster there on Devin Cutter. Devin Cutter doing oh. a double drop kick to the head. Well, he's lucky he slid out of the ring, Chris. He may have been pinned there. How long is the ref going to let those two guys stay in the ring? What? It's been like 20 seconds. Yeah, I see nothing wrong with this. Look at that knees in the corner. Here's Zach Thompson now. What is this? Oh, big drop kick to the gut. The elevation by Jimmy Rockwell. Zach Thompson just throws his feet into the chest of Devin. Crowd really into this here early at Turner Rec Center. Heroes for hiring complete control. I'm, I'm glad the referee finally realized he has to count at some point. Look at this. Oh, big Elevated splash. body press. The knees down on the midsection. The leg is hooked. This could be it already. No, just a two count. Oh my goodness, get out of the ring. Hey, he's only been in there for about three minutes, Chris. Give him a break. Yeah, divided by five seconds. That's a lot. Here we go. Working over Jimmy Rockwell. Now they should stay in there for another three minutes themselves. I think the referee was calling it fair, Chris. I mean, after the cheap shot, the cutters oh. broke out in the opening moments. I think Pierce for Hire deserves a break. Yeah. It's Funny. in my personal rule book. Funny you should say that. Look at that. Drop the elbow on Jimmy Rockwell. It's a big elbow when you're talking about Devin Cutter delivering that. And Mason Cutter telling the fans they are number one and they are in my book as well. I don't think it's what he was saying, Chris. I don't think it's what he was saying at all. Here we go. Devin Cutter pounded on the back. Man, these guys, they're big, they're agile. Come on, let's get the five cat yes. right Let's get let's get the five cat here. Thank you. Double headbutt. They're in there forever. You're such a hypocrite. What? 
One, two, three. Yes, three, count three, faster. Three, Surprised Mason could even count that high. A, how can this referee count three seconds within under five minutes? They're never going to win this match, anybody. Crowd urging on. Jimmy Rockwell trying to get back up to his feet. Ah, oh, but a rake of the eyes. That always works. Always works. Here we go. Front face lock now on Jimmy Rockwell. Devin Cutter tags in. Look at this wide open. <laughs> Knife edge chop. Devin Cutter really dishing out the pain here. On oh, another. Just taking down the Wolverine wannabe. Except this guy doesn't have any claws, so he's not going to do any damage on the likes of Devin Cutter. Oh, really? Yeah. You don't think he could do any damage, even though they were in complete control here early in the match? Here we go. Look, setting him up on that second rope. Oh, he spit at him, Chris. That's disgusting. Zach Thompson coming in, and oh, look, the referee's on. distracted. And yeah, Chris, look at this. It's intentional cheating. Why don't you look? Open your eyes. Mason's trying to teach their runt little brother how to win a match, and he's not taking their advice. Don't have any comment, Chris, on the illegal tactics we just saw? I'm just seeing two bigger brothers trying to teach their stupid younger brother how to be a man, and he apparently doesn't want to be one. Sorry he wants to play fair and square, trying to win without cheating. I know that's a despicable action by you. Hey, you're not trying if you're not cheating, Dave. Have you heard of college basketball? Heard that dumb saying in racing. Robin's racing. Here we go. Big close on by Devin. No doubt a big clothesline when you got a guy that big with all his weight behind him. Here we him. go, it's over. Only a two count. Waiting for these tag team championships to change hands. Finally, Dave, the hooligans are going to do it tonight. Will those belts even fit around the waist of the hooligans? Who cares? They'll put them above their mantle. Big kick, big right hand on the face of Jimmy Rockwell by Mason. Rockwell in desperate need of a tag here. Can he get it? No. Now in the wrong corner, certainly not in the right spot now as Mason tags in. Big right hand by Devin. Can't you tell these guys apart, Dave? It's so obvious. Oh, it's so obvious. Here we go, Devin off the ropes. Oh, huge right of clothesline. Look, There's that standing standing moonsault. Moonsault. Unbelievable move. Oh, but I think it's the illegal man in the ring, Chris. Look, the, re oh, the referee wants to pay attention all of a sudden. They can't even tell themselves apart. They, they, know they, know exactly man is. they know exactly what's going on. They figured this referee's so stupid, he's not going to pick up on anything. They would have had the correct man covering. I think they may have been the new tag team champs, Chris. Here we go. Shinlock now. And of Zach Devin in the ring right now, Chris. Everyone knows that. Of course, that. of course. I know that. You don't. I just said it. Go get some glasses. Zach Thompson trying to get in this match. Batman Jr. over there, but no. Come on, Chris. Let's clap. I don't clap. Oh, he pulled the hair. Come on, Raph. They can pull Devin's hair. No, he has no hair, Chris. Unless he pulls his beard. Here comes Mason in. He's a cover. Actually, not a bad idea. Is Rockwell able to kick out? Mason. Looking at his brother, maybe thinking of uh, what they're going to be doing to finish this match off so they can take those titles back home. Big punch to the face, and a now forearm to the face. Here Cutters we go. complete control here. Into the corner he goes. <laughs> Followed it up with a big boot by Rockwell. Oh, big fly cross body, but he's in a lot of pain from all the punishment he's taking. Rockwell needs to get out of here if he has any chance to not get defeated by the Cutters anytime soon. And look, Mason flips over and tags in Devin. What an acrobatic tag. Can Rockwell get there? No, yes. not quite. Just toying with him, toying with the heroes for hire. Oh, what a jerk. Devin Cutter saying he's almost there. Would you ever hire these guys for anything? The Cutters? No, I don't think they could do anything. No, I'm talking about their name, moron. Heroes for Hire. Come on. Yeah, of course. For what? He's got anything. What? Halloween, Halloween party? party? No, these guys are great. They can do anything you needed them to do. Dress up like X-Men? Is that what you need? Shut up, Chris. They're going to drop Give the titles to the hooligans. To the tag team champs. I've been giving them respect for a year. Oh, clearly. It's time to pass the baton Very down. respectful you are. Jimmy Rockwell still down. Zach Thompson, he has not been in this match for 10 minutes. Big forearm shot by Mason. Into the corner he goes. 
Oh, yeah. big boost to the face by Rockwell. Another big boost. We saw the sweet sequence oh. earlier, but look, no, dropping the double knee on the chest of Mason. And now, Jimmy Rockwell has got to get to his corner if he's going to have a shot. It's been a desperate need of attack for several minutes now. Can he finally get it? Zach Thompson waiting. Come on, Mason. Come on. Yes. He gets there first. And here comes Devin again. Oh, and again, just inches short of the tag. Cutting him off. Zach Thompson, look, what's he gonna do? Nothing. Oh, Insiguri. Here we go. He's, He's got an attack, Chris. No! Huge clothesline by Zach Thompson. Taking out both the Cutter twins. Here we go. Just cleaning house here at Turner Rack Center. Thompson flexing, but here comes Devin, big right hand. Oh, and Jimmy Rockwell, all four men in the ring now. This referee's lost all hope in this match. Zazi calls the hooligans the winners and new tag team champions is all I care about. Shut up, Chris. Big knife edge chop, and now it's turned into a real melee here in the ring. Here we go, Mason throwing Zach out to the outside. Neil Diamond could help him out a little bit, maybe. Big boot by Mason. Man, how does a guy that big get his boot up that high? Here we go. Oh. Oh. See his head snap back? Oh. Yes, running cannonball into the head of Jimmy Rockwell. As if the butt to the face running it. Running butt wasn't enough, Chris. Look at this. Tag team maneuver here, Dave. I'll actually agree with you. I think we're about to see a new champ here. Look oh. at that double foot to the chest of Jimmy Rockwell. A big stomp off the middle ropes. And look, what a voice Zach Thompson in this match. That's what partners are for, Chris. He's helping out his fallen partner. The Hooligans had the tag team titles right there, but now. Devin and Zach going at it now. Oh, nice drop kick in midair by Zach Thompson. Oh, it's a Gurry now on Mason Cutter. Zach Thompson totally coming to the rescue of Jimmy Rockwell. Lost track, Chris. Who's the legal man right now? A Cutter? Well, yes, of course, it's one of go. the Cutters, you idiot. Nails the back. Here's another tag team. This is it. It's over. All the way to the top row. What's this, Chris? What are the American Bulldogs? Why are they out here? Look at this. Zach Thompson rolls up Devin. Oh, he got the shoulders pinned and they retained their title. What a cheap victory. Why in the heck is Mad Dog McDowell and Jonathan Winston the American Bulldogs? Why are they out here? Thank goodness for the American Bulldogs just even in the play of field, Chris. This is your This match was decided for the This is not going to be the end. You know what? We've seen we've seen the Hooligans defeat the American Bulldogs. Apparently, they can't take a look at that. John West being so sarcastic. You little smart Alec. They're going to come there and wipe that grin off your face. Hooligans now 0 for 2 in title matches. And, you know, that was the commissioner. I think these guys deserve to be set to the back of the line, Chris. Okay, they got DQ'd and then they got interfered with. No, no, there's no way to fear it. Yes, they came out here to distract the hooligans, and now the Heroes for Hire retain their tag team championships. Like I said, I think it's back to the line with the hooligans. They've shown they're not good enough to like, beat the Heroes for are Hire. Are you kidding me? No, I'm not. They, no. had, they had this match 99% of the match. We're going to play this middle of the stupid game. 99% of this match was all hooligans. If that idiot would have went over there, Neil Diamond would have been taking their friends and their brother. Yeah, they would have taken out the American Bulldogs, man, and hit the tanky team. He's supposed to take out both the American Bulldogs by himself. Instead, he, like, played Kissy Face with Matt Dugdell a couple weeks ago. Look, it's not over for the hooligans. You know, brother, they're coming back and they're going to take those titles. Give some credits. Heroes for Hires, still the champs after a great victory here tonight. Love it.